Okay, hello everyone. I'm going to show you how to create your account to expand your business using the Pride Drive CRM platform. So, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and click this try for free. But before that, you can actually go and uh, go to your browser and click pipedrive.com. And there's a lot of opportunities, products, the pricings, and actually more. Let's save that for later. Now we can go ahead and click try for free uh, to create your account. You can actually use your any account or any email account that you currently are uh, having. So, but before that, you have uh, after that, you can actually click this checkbox by signing up because you have to accept the terms of service and privacy notice. So, uh, you can actually create your own account here, or you can actually go ahead and click this Google Drive, Google. To access using a Google account, so I'm go ahead. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and use this Google account and click my Google account uh, email to create or start an account here in PipeDrive. So once done, you're actually gonna enter your name here. Let's just say I'm Ken. I'm going to create a password. That is going to be the um, the basis of my uh of this account so uh once you created your account and uh, once you actually type in your information your basic information here you can actually you just have to sign again to click this checkbox by signing up you actually accept uh the terms of service and privacy notice of the pipe drive so go ahead and let's continue that so in the next page we have here is the title described jobs. So let's just say I'm a VIP or CEO. Let's just say I haven't used any tools before. So uh, what do you want to do first is that in this section is that you can actually go and set up a team, set goals, manage relationship better, find new leads, and close deals faster. This is actually your purpose of creating an account. I'm going ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and click manage relationship manage relationship better so go ahead and click any comp your company name and let's just say i this is for uh kin this is a king uh company i'm a type one so how big is your company company industry let's just say that this is an it um and go ahead and click one here once you enter the pipeline a pipe drive you can actually see here some uh, getting started account is getting starting uh, 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 notifications here that you can actually add to your uh, uh, to your data or, your, or if you wanted to uh, commit in this uh, platform. So let's go ahead and Xbox that. However, that is still helpful for you to create this account. So once you got in here, you can uh, actually what's you got in here uh this is actually a deals uh this is actually a leads uh this is actually the leads box if you can see here in the in the left side this there have there is a navigation panel here that uh, has leads deals uh ca projects campaigns sales activities contacts insights products and marketplace so you can actually create a leads inbox by click, clicking this button here. Now once you've done that, you can actually go ahead and add a lead. Uh, in this part, you can actually go and type the clients that you have, that the new client that you have, and create the title and organizations or the title name of that uh, uh, client's order. And you can actually put a value here and labels and one thing that you can actually add here is that um you can ask the phone numbers and the emails so let's go ahead and let's go to deals uh, however let's go to the project let's skip the deals let's go to the projects so one of the most important thing here is to create actually a project for your business uh, this is actually very easy and this is a use default apart or use stage names for existing. You can actually 
I'll use stage names from an existing deals pipelines. I'm going to go ahead and use default names for creating a new project. So in this part is actually uh, uh, it, once you gathered informations and once you, you uh, wanted to propose a project, you can actually click here and create your own new projects here. Um, once you're in this project, you can actually, you can actually click here uh, a plus project button here to create a new project and create a lot uh, and create a project name, uh, start date, end date, and delivery. Uh, and board delivery or board or it's or if it has a delivery so you can actually create and save that you can put your deals contact persons organizations labels and other description to make it more details and um to can make it more uh possible in your uh, project so once then that if you want it uh, once the kickoff has been initiated you can actually go ahead and drag this one for the uh, for the um, uh, planning. So once then that, you can actually go ahead and click this one. Create. You can actually put some uh, uh, list here. You can click a link here and create and also put ads. Uh, add actually some uh, uh, informations. So once you have here, once you can see here, then kick off and then the planning, uh, you can create tasks and activities of, of in the planning uh, part. So uh, same thing as go in the implementations, you can actually go ahead and click that and uh, you can actually go ahead and click active, add activities or app tasks, reviews and closings. So once done that, you can actually click here. Once all of your this project is actually done, you can actually click here, completed, and you can actually cancel this uh, project if you want. So let's go ahead to the campaign. In campaign, just click here, uh, get started for free. Uh, you have this uh, activity campaigns, confirm and confirm and start trial. Once you are in the uh, email campaign, uh, you can actually go ahead and click some automate. You can actually have options here. We have email templates, automate campaigns, and create and actually create an email campaign. So you can go ahead and click the email campaign button here and click. And you can see here you can uh, add some uh, information here. Email, con email content, sending time, and engagement. So yeah. So let's go ahead and go in the activities. In the activity page, you can actually create a new activity or your projects or if you're running a business. You can actually, there is a in the activity or in the schedule and activity page or in the pop-up box, you can actually go ahead for a uh, Click for a uh, purpose, whether it's a call for meeting, task, deadline, or email, and even for lunch. So uh, there is a time difference, the time time uh, differentials here. You can go ahead and create visible notes and actually create a specific deadlines here or the schedules. Now let's go to the contacts and actually you can go ahead and click contacts by uh, clicking the new, con new contact person here in the green button. You can actually go ahead and add a person. So if you have an employee or uh, or your uh, business, par business partners, you can actually create your ad persons here or the organizations, even for clients, this is uh, applicable. So yeah, you can put, go ahead and put the phone number, which is and also email email accounts. That is very important in your um, business. Now we are here in the insights. You can actually see here about your dashboards. You can create your reports. You can create your other uh, gun charts. You can create a lot of things here that is helpful for your uh, business to. 
uh, grow and actually create an evaluations analysis for your uh, improve for the improvements of your uh, uh, ways of organizations or ways or even methods so yeah so that is all for the uh, pipe drive tutorial and I wanted to uh, this is actually a very helpful uh, platform that you can use uh, this is um, by far the uh, one of the best I think one of the best it's not that really good but it's actually one of the good uh, one of the uh, satisfactory uh, level you can actually use this for creating or starting a business that is for uh, whether it is for uh, engagement with other uh, customers, uh, social medias, and more. Now let's go ahead and go to the pricing. So you can see here in the pricing, there are a lot of you know, uh, uses that we can actually, uh, you know, there are a lot of options here that we can actually use. We have the essentials, the essentials offers of lead steel, deal, deal contact cal calendar and pipeline management, uh, data imports of 4,000, uh, 400, plus integrations and 24-7 multilingual support. You can actually pay for $12 of you $12 for this um plan. We have also here the advanced which is a $24 a advanced plan. Uh one of the best thing here is the uh full email sync and templates with templates open and click tracking and group email emailing automation builder and meeting email and video call scheduling so all of this here combine all of this here uh, goes in there plus the this uh, descriptions here the next thing here is the professional we can use this professional as for the most and actually the most popular plan for pipe drive so essential advanced essential plus advanced uh, features here uh, goes into the advanced plan and actually adds the streamline lead routing and accounts access controls for teams, documents, revenue, and extra deal and field customizations options here. So you can actually another one is the power plan. You can this is actually a best value, which is a fifty nine dollar a plan. Uh, all of this, uh, all of the uh, features here plus. All of the features of essential advanced professionals plus the project planning phone support scalable control and ideal for increasingly busy pipelines and complex thing called structures so last year we have the enterprise plan which is 74 dollars uh the feature key features of essential advanced professional power plans are com are all already combined here plus enhanced security preferences complete access to all features Unlimited reports and customization and double the number of automation per use. So uh, it is up to you or it is up for you if you if your business requires a lot of uh, uh, plannings, uh, planning and uh, expanding a lot, you can still use the most popular which is the professional. So that's it for this video and I hope you like this video. I hope this um, this actually uh, gives you a lot of learnings or or a idea on how to use pipe drive and the pricing is up and pricing of it pipe drive. So uh, that's the end for this video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.